Let him go. I stand. Let him go. You tell me she did to her. I'll beat the hell out of your hands off me. I didn't do a damn thing to her. God. And you. You must have done it, you vindictive little slut. You're the one no, who doesn't like it. You're no. the one who'll do it. What did you do to her? Nothing. What? I, what? I... If you stop shouting, somebody could answer your questions. Let him talk. Talk. Gina and I both had the urge to visit Sophia, and we ran into each other outside her room. Skip the long-winded explanation. Tell me what the hell happened. I'm trying to tell you I don't know. The emergency was in progress when we went into the room. Gina had nothing to do with it, and neither did I. You're lying to me. What? Why? Why? Because the sun came up this morning. Because it didn't come up. I haven't ever to figure out your brother. Or... I am guilty of nothing. Look, why don't I go to the nurse's station and see if I can find out what's going on? Why don't you do that? Thank you, Greg. Doctor, you, let's talk to him. Tell me she's all right. It was close, but she's past the emergency. What happened? Well, she had what we call a uh, heart episode. It's not an attack, although it manifests itself in the same way. It's not unlike a severe panic attack. Is she still in danger? Oh, no, she's stabilized. We're monitoring her closely. That would be nice. Well, and CC, I'm afraid no visitors. Pardon me for being blunt, Doctor. I'm not a visitor. I happen to be a husband who almost lost his wife, so if you don't mind, I will go into that room to see her. Just don't take too long. She really needs to rest. You know, I don't know what brought on that incident, but I do know that she owes you her life. If you hadn't been so quick, this story would have had a dramatically different ending. You saved... Her life? She's not my favorite person, Kelly, but I have no desire to see her dead. She's your mother, for God's sake. Why didn't you tell Daddy? I stopped meeting gold stars a long time ago. Mason, he just practically accused you of, of murder. God, he's incredibly out of line. He... Attacking me justifies his existence. Who am I to take away his reason for living? Mason, Look, just... the discussion is over. I thank you both for your sentiments. But I have no intention of telling him, and nothing you say is going to change my mind. 